Okay, seriously, internet, we need to talk. Apparently, many of you are under the impression that everything is awesome. Yes, everything is indeed awesome these days, isn't it? And that's a problem because, and this is important, people, words actually mean things. Eddie Izzard, the comedian and action transvestite, talked about this 15 years ago, calling out the overuse of awesome to describe everything from socks to hot dogs. I saw an advert for awesome hot dogs, only $2.99. If they were awesome, you'd be going, I cannot breathe for the way the sausage is held by the bun. It is. If you're going to describe socks and hot dogs as awesome, what have you got left when you come across something that actually, truly inspires awe? Okay, here, look, case in point. Here's a picture of the night sky from the lovely people at NASA. Every one of those stars is inside our galaxy, the Milky Way. If you live somewhere nice and dark, like in a desert or at the top of a mountain in Chile, then you can see the Milky Way really well. But what you can't see is the shape of the galaxy. Astronomers have studied the location and motion of lots and lots of these stars, and they figured out that the Milky Way looks like this, a spiral. Now, there are lots of other spiral-shaped galaxies in the universe, like this one, the Andromeda Galaxy, also known as M31. It's our nearest galactic neighbour, two and a half million light years away. Now, sorry, but it's really just too easy to casually throw around a sentence like that. So let me say it again. This is a picture of another galaxy, two and a half million light years away. That means that the light captured in this image now left the Andromeda galaxy two and a half million years ago, which is around about the time that our early Homo habilis ancestors first stood up straight, lost all their body hair, mucked around with some stone tools and thought, hey, maybe it's time we moved out of Africa. My point is this. Even though it's nearby in the cosmic sense, just remember that Andromeda is a very, very long way away. Now, here's a more recent portrait of Andromeda that NASA released back in January 2015. It's a much more detailed panoramic view of around one quarter of the M31 galaxy. That's very pretty, sure, and we're all used to pretty pictures from NASA by now, but I want to show you something. See all these larger, brighter stars? Let's zoom in around one of them. That big twinkly one there, that's actually a star in the Milky Way, not M31. It's in our galaxy, between us and Andromeda. That's why it looks so big and twinkly. But all those tiny dots, the ones that look like a, a cheap camera's photographic noise, they're not noise. They're stars in Andromeda, in the other galaxy. As the people at NASA put it, it's like photographing a beach and being able to resolve individual grains of sand. We've never had such a detailed view of any galaxy outside the Milky Way before. Details so rich, you can see a hundred million individual stars. OK, now stay with me for one last zoom. This is what I wanted to show you. In this frame, you can see a few bright stars in our own galaxy in the foreground against a backdrop of millions of stars in Andromeda in another galaxy. But look, there, in the tiny gaps between the stars in Andromeda are even more galaxies, far more distant, way behind Andromeda, just a few of the hundreds of billions of galaxies in the entire universe. Now, just take a moment to let all of that sink in properly. Do you feel that? Uh, a light, slightly fizzy sensation in your brain? If you do, then that, my friend, is awe. The real deal. And if you don't, well, there's nothing I can do for you. That feeling is why we have astronomy. And NASA, and the European Space Agency, and the Russian and Chinese and Japanese and Indian Space Agencies, and why we love Brian Cox and Maggie Adair and Pocock and Neil deGrasse Tyson on the telly. It's why scientists are the modern day explorers. It's why we have science. Because images like this one, give us a view of the universe that is truly, literally awesome.